what's going on guys um my name's bear witness and today I, I i'm in a bad sort and this is kind of a video that i didn't want to have to make anytime soon but uh I, I don't even know how to say it because primarily i upload fortnite right and i enjoy i enjoy making fortnite videos for you guys and i enjoy making content in general you know informing people i like the better ways of how to win more games or how to have better positioning when you're in squads and such you know i, I love making those types of videos that are just informational and such but uh i've been playing fortnite season five for uh, i'd say in total a good six six or seven hours and it is probably the worst season of Fortnite so far. And the reason why I say that comes from a lot of places. One of the first ones being the blatant and uncanny, like, shotgun nerf that was so unnecessary. I, I would... It, it's kind of like... It, I, I can't even think of a good analogy. I'm, I'm so tilted right now. But I just... I don't know. I feel like where the games go on longer because they added so many places and so many points of interest inside of the uh, the new Paradise Palms location. There's so, so many different places you can actually uh, go to in that situation that make it so that people constantly are going to like these these places and they're constantly spending so many time there, so much time there that the rest of the map it seems like not so fleshed out. And, and it's not that I can't win, guys. Let's let's put the petty stuff out the way. Oh, you're bad. Oh, you don't. You can't. You can't. You you just don't know how to play it. No, none of that's true, guys. I have so many gameplays of the wins lately. I'm not gonna say I'm gonna sit here and say I'm the best player, but I've gotten so much more wins lately that it's ridiculous. But that's that's not the point. The point is, is that in this situation, you spend a good like everybody goes to those areas. You, you got like 30 people at the end of a solo game and, and they because you spend like 15 minutes fighting or, or, or looting it's not it's not fun you, and then you just get you, like you get killed by randomness I, I can't tell you the most frustrating thing on the planet is when you're shooting directly at somebody and then you hit you only hit them like four times out of one clip like you can't untell me that that makes sense to you epic like like I don't understand that. And then everybody complains about how shotguns don't are, are do too much damage, but they only do good amounts of damage in close quarters. It wasn't like they were sniper rifles. It wasn't like they were, oh, say, the KSG in Black Ops 2. Now, that's something that you could actually be frustrated about, but these are buckshot shotguns that aren't really doing that much damage. So, in this situation, explain to me what's so wrong about a shotgun doing what they're supposed to do at close range. Now, the, the, this is something that consistently pops up. And there's some people that say, oh, hey, the shotgun nerf is great. Uh, just because you, you, know, you double pump doesn't mean that you're going to be able to you know get kills anymore like it's not it's not fair and they the thing is is that it's not necessarily the fact that they took away the double shotgun it's the fact that they have blatantly and without regard for anybody else's like take on it have run the shotguns which is one of the main weapons in a third person shooter into the ground without any like give a fucks at all they just completely were like you know what we're changing this we're making it so you can't do it anymore it's not fair because the people that don't traditionally play third person shooters are upset about it are they don't enjoy it it's not fun for them and because we want their money that's the way that's what we're gonna do we're gonna make it fun for them while everybody that's been playing this game for months and trying to practice and make getting better get thrown into a fucking trash can called too bad so sad it's really annoying if anything else and I'm not sitting here this isn't a plea to get people to stop playing it I just want you guys to know my opinion based on um, season 5. I completely think that this is the season that the game kind of got ran into the ground. I don't think that there are a lot of things that they can do to fix it because they've already, they're have already they already in that mode where they are coddling people. They are coddling the players that are brand new and they are not rewarding players that have been playing this game for the longest amount of time. And I personally cannot stand 
I, I, I can't stand it. So, I guess, I guess, uh, sorry for the large pause, guys. Um, I guess what I'm trying to say is, is I don't know how much more, uh, Fortnite I will be doing on the channel. Uh, I obviously won't stop playing the game. Like, I'll play it here and there, and I will update you guys on some of the key parts. And say they do fix some of the key problems that I was talking about. And here's another thing that I just want to touch on before I finish the rest of that. It's the fact that... If they were to make this decision and say, oh, hey, guess what? We're taking out the shotguns and we're, we're, we're taking out the double pump or the double shotgun meta. We're taking it out and we're running it into the ground completely. Now, don't get me wrong here. There's one thing I want to touch on is the fact that it was not the meta. This was so uncalled for based on the fact that if anybody was a part of them, anybody that was running double shotguns was doing it because they enjoyed it. And it was a play style. When you completely take away a person's play style based on the fact that you don't want them to have burst damage, which is what that was. After those two shotgun shots, nine times out of ten, if somebody had 200 health, they were getting built on. So if you can't build after you hit those two shotgun shots that were already hitting like trash anyway, then there was nothing you could do. So, what I'm saying here to you guys is this. I don't... The, the, what, what they should have done in this situation was they should have went and they should have been like, Okay, so since we're nerfing this, we are going to go ahead and give you your one pump shotguns back. Or your high damage shotguns. Maybe not even one pump, you know? But high damage shotgun damage back. We're gonna give that to you back because we're taking away a mechanic you use to make up for the fact that we nerfed shotguns into the ground anyway. This was something that they didn't even really take time in. I really feel like this was a last minute decision and if anybody has information on that then I would love to know. But based on this, guys, like I said, I don't, I don't know what I'm going to be uploading. I would like to play some Call of Duty, and I would like to play some Battlefield for you guys, because that's what I'll be playing this fall. I already planned on that earlier, so I might bring you guys some Call of Duty gameplays. I'm not sure how you guys are going to react to those, so bear with me, guys. But nonetheless, I'll still be doing my giveaway, and I will still be giving away two Battle Passes next Thursday, so make sure you guys sign up, and the Gleam giveaway in the description below. Thank you guys so much for watching this rant video, I guess, and I will see you guys next time. Peace.